I read this and I said, I don't think this is an aberration. This could so easily happen. I mean, I, I have a friend named Alexa. You'd be sending stuff there. I mean, not everything is that you, you don't want to share everything. There's things that you say that you don't necessarily want to send to, you know, somehow, like I mentioned Alexa, you know, my friend Alexa, and then I mentioned David in the same, you know, within the same paragraph. Right. And you're going to find out things about her that I'm not that thrilled about. Well, it goes to the larger issues of privacy, which we've been talking about a great deal, of course, given what's going on in Europe. Uh, right. And the questions about what these devices that are proliferating in American households at a rapid rate really are recording or not. Well, recording. we don't know it. I mean, I'm yeah. changing my. I'm going to call my friend Lexi. She answers to Alexa and Lexi. I mean, I think that anyone you have to think about saying the word Alexa around this device, and that's what I think is going to be the big takeaway. It does. It does sort of feed though this this long narrative of can software trade stocks effectively, right. efficiently, safely? Right. Can they drive a car safely? Can they uh, maintain the sound in your, in your home not safely? Yet. Not yet. And I think that what we're learning is, is that there's a downside to these. I mean, the other day on this set, I, had my, I didn't know I had my phone on. And I said, you, know, you can't be serious. And in it immediately says, can I hear that again? We had to do, <laughs> we had to do the block over. I mean, it was like, you know, like Regina Gilding said, Jim, do you have your phone on? And I'm like, I wanted to say, like, well, you can't be serious. But, of course, then she would just compound things. I think that this is a real issue. And I think that what happens is people are eventually going to say, this is not what I want in my house. Really? Even you really though believe, I really, love it. Really believe that? If people oh, will there's choose. a lot of privacy freaks. There are a lot, but there are also a lot of people who prefer the convenience of having a device that they can talk to. And it, by the way, we're at the early stages now in terms of what the AI is going to be able to accomplish not when to you mention, get to 5G and just all of the different applications you haven't well, even thought of. Once, yet. once we get to a generation where this is just sort of the base, this is the bar where you begin, voice assistant. Yeah, of course. Yeah. It is going to happen. It is going to happen. But one of the things that I, I'm not a Luddite, I think that I like the device. You know, Alexa, play some culture. You want to... I mean, yeah, I'm what always I, amazed. I it's like, your phone. Doesn't anybody know I'm but, on wait, TV wait, now? No, no, doesn't this, anybody no, know? No, Alexa doesn't. This could be a call about one of your friends. No, it's a banker. Take it. See what it it's is. It's a banker. It's very disappointing. It's definitely Alexa. It's only been on for 25 years. Uh, my wife doesn't know I have a show. I say anything I want. Oh. Anyway, go ahead. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. It's a, just part of a ton of Fang news today. There's the oh Amazon my God, it's Alexa Fang stuff. Day. There's uh, the Netflix market cap race, which yeah. we've been talking about. We got GDPR taking effect. We do. Today. Um, you know, guys, before we end on Alexa, I think the larger question, of course, that we have been dealing with a little bit on Amazon is simply the ubiquity of, of Amazon itself. These are not going to stop uh, being used in homes, I don't think, no. and or grow as a huge growth industry for Amazon to actually be an adjunct, if not eventually be a central part of its business. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.